All right, let's get started. Someone from the village said that something strange is happening in the village. Wow, just look at this. What is this? JJ, get away from my rainbow base right now. I didn't give you permission to come here. Mikey, is that really you? What are you doing inside this base? Why didn't you call me? Because this is only my rainbow base. If you try to come here, I will destroy and fight you. I built it specifically to be here alone. I will not share it with you, much less let you walk in it. This is my base. Mikey, if you don't give me permission to come in, I will simply destroy your rainbow base and kick you out of there. You wouldn't dare do that. This is my rainbow base and I spent a lot of time and effort to build it. So I can kick out and invite anyone here. But you didn't invite your best friend. It would be really terrible. And I can say for sure that I definitely won't help you. Friends, I apparently have no other choice. I need to destroy Mikey's rainbow base. Let's run as fast as possible to get the weapons I have. He really doesn't understand that it was a big mistake not to invite me to his rainbow base because I'll just go and destroy everything he loves so much. Mikey will really regret not inviting me. I had no other choice because I wanted to visit this base myself. Don't even think about coming. It would be the worst thing you could do. Don't touch my rainbow base. You still won't be able to become small because I won't give you a special device that makes you small. Come out, Mikey, and accept this fight. I know that you can just hide in this rainbow base and do nothing. It really sounds very interesting. I just want to say that you did a bad thing, did not call me, and hid this rainbow base because the villagers told me about it. No one wanted to tell you. You stole my cookies and I decided to just hide them safely in this base. What? I did not steal your cookies. You must have mixed something up or forgotten. I told you why I did all this. I just want to be alone. Do not touch my base and do not try to destroy it. You have crossed all the possible boundaries. You did not act like a true friend and I do not even know what to do now. Your base is so strong that no weapon can take it. How is this even possible? I want to finish all this as soon as possible to see it through to the end. It will be truly fair and there will be no problems. I want to destroy your rainbow base so that you won't boast about it and will become completely ordinary in the village. It will be fair. No one gives me the opportunity to do what I want. This is really a real prison. They took away the cookies, then the rainbow base. Just leave here and never come back. You really can't destroy me and my base. Because you yourself are incredibly weak, JJ. You don't have the necessary weapons and strength to do it. I'm incredibly angry that I can't break through this base. Mikey just runs around and laughs at me. I want to somehow punish him for all his words and actions because he really deserves all this more than anyone else right now. That's why I need to come up with a plan on how to do it. Where should I approach and maybe use magic? Nothing will ever be able to help you defeat me. It will simply be unrealistic. Remember my words and write them down. You will not defeat me. Don't even think about it. Hmm, magic. Maybe a wizard can make me small. Let's go to him and ask him to do it for me. Have to become small to get inside Mikey's rainbow base and fight him there. I need to defeat him and destroy him. It would really be fair. I just want to blow his rainbow base apart so he can never build anything like that in the village again. Wow, guys, what's going on here? Why are there so many zombies near the village? Apparently, I need to find out more about this from the wizard and ask him what I need to do to make me small, but it seems to me that he will give me exactly this task. Wizard, I need to become really small to get into Mikey's rainbow base. Can you do something like that with me? Yes, I can do it with you, but you must understand that I need something in return. These zombies are really bothering me. If you can destroy them all, I will do whatever you want. I don't want to waste my energy on them. I'm already very old. So these crystals fall from zombies? Okay, wizard, we've agreed. I destroy all the zombies and you give me the superpower of being small. Be careful. They are all very dangerous, strong and fast. These are not ordinary zombies and you will have a hard time with them alone. Okay, friends, let's go fight the zombies. We need to destroy them with our powerful weapons. Okay, friends, we're going to attack these zombies. It's going to be really hard for them to fight me. I have a lot of different weapons and they won't be able to hold out for long. I'm going to hit them over and over again. 
You just have to remember why I'm doing all this. I'm going to destroy all these zombies to take their crystals. Once I destroy them all and take all the crystals, then I'll go to the mage and buy some special magic that will make me small. I really hope there won't be any problems and we can do it really fast. We'll attack Mikey's rainbow base right away. I can't believe my friend did something like this and didn't tell me. It's really weird. It's like a betrayal. Anyway, he laughed at me afterwards. That's why I'm just ready to hit him over and over again. He definitely deserves it. I'll take the laughter off his face and then he'll understand that he doesn't need to flood me. This will truly be the final and epic battle. Mikey doesn't have a weapon and he'll have to run for me all over the rainbow base. I'll be able to punish him very quickly and really show him where he's wrong and what he's already done. That's really the most important thing for me. You have to be careful with these zombies. I can't let them surround me. Then I can get trapped and they can destroy me. This is really planned to be a big and long battle because we have to resolve everything as quickly as possible and win without any problems. This is the most important thing. The faster we do all this, the better it will be. I wanna see it through to the very end and win. This will be really important and cool. I just wanna overcome all the difficulties and show everyone how cool everything can be and how we can win because this is really the most important and interesting thing. I want to see this battle through to the very end. Collect all the crystals and buy this power. I really need it. Mikey will be surprised if I become small and chase him all over the rainbow base. He will be really scared of me. There are not many zombies left here, so I need to step up my efforts and destroy them all. They are threatening the village and it is my job to defeat them. Anyway, Mikey and I were supposed to do this, but he went off to build Rainbow Base and make it his home. It is really scary. I really hope to see this through to the very end and solve everything without any problems. It will be really cool and I hope there will be no problems. That is the most important thing. Come on, zombies, attack me. I am ready to destroy you all. You probably don't even understand who you are attacking. I am JJ, and I am protecting this village. I will destroy you all and not let you through. I need you for my goal, and I am ready to destroy each of you. Crew, this is a really long battle. I'm already a little tired of running from them. The wizard was right. They are much faster than I thought. I have 100% defeated almost all of them. All that's left is to collect the crystals, and then I can go to the wizard. I really did all of this. Friends, this is a really tough battle, and I hope you enjoyed it. In any case, now we'll soon go to Mikey to chase and scare him in his rainbow base. There are really very few of them left, and now we can go to the wizard. He will definitely sell me everything I need, and then we'll go punish Mikey. He must return back to the village. These are the last zombies left, and I'm finally finishing this mission. The village will be safe, just like the villagers, there won't be any problems. True, friends, I finally did it. I was able to defeat all the zombies. Now it's time to go back to the wizard and back to the village. I'm about to give Mikey a surprise that he definitely won't be happy about because I'm going to take over his rainbow base and him. Here it is, friends, it's in my hands. Let's check how it works. Yoo-hoo, this is really what I needed. Now with this size, I can get into Mikey's rainbow base and attack him from inside. He definitely won't be able to escape from me this time. Wizard, thank you very much. Now I need to finish my business and punish Mikey for all his words and how he laughed at me. But moving around in such a small size is very, very difficult. But I don't even weigh anything, so we can fall from a great height without any problems. I can definitely punish Mikey for all the laughing at me. He also accused me of stealing his cookies. Although Mikey likes to do that, maybe he stole a lot of cookies to make himself a secret rainbow base where he hid everything so no one would see. How do you like that idea? Let's fly a little to Mikey and find out there what he did to escape from our village to the rainbow base. It really must be something dangerous. He certainly won't expect me to become small and be able to get into his base and punish him. Now I'm going to give Mikey a real surprise and destroy him. It's going to be really fun. I promise my friends that this race and hunt for Mikey will be incredibly fun because he definitely won't expect me like this. I'll fall on his rainbow base and run after him, trying to destroy him. He wanted to fight me. Let's see how he does it all. 
I'll really be interested in this and we'll solve it without any problems. What? Where are you from, JJ, and why are you so small? It's not fair! I decided to give you a surprise, Mikey. I'm going to fight you now and look for you in your rainbow base. I want to finish the job and win. In any case, I just have to make the last step and we've already won. Hey, don't even think about doing that. You shouldn't be here at all. How did you get so small? I bought a mechanism from a wizard for special crystals that made me small. Now I can climb where you can. You won't be able to escape from me and I will attack you very hard. You must understand that you made a big mistake by being aggressive towards me. Now I will respond to you in kind and will look for you. Where are you running to? You wanted to fight me so badly. Try to catch up with me. I know my rainbow base better than anyone else. You won't be able to do this and I will be forever safe. I will make you run in your own base. This is already enough for me because this is incredibly funny and you must understand this. No one else can do anything to me. Ouch, JJ uses a flamethrower, a lot of different weapons, but I have nothing and I have to run from him. Run as much as you can, Mikey, but it still won't save you. You will get your punishment for making me angry. It's really easy to get lost in this rainbow base because all the walls look the same. It's really weird. I get confused all the time. That's the main advantage of this base because the enemies don't know where to run and forget everything. I already remember everything perfectly because this is my base. Mikey, admit it. What did you do? Why did you build this base? Did you steal cookies from the villagers and from me? I know you can do that. How could you even think that? I'm not some kind of thief. I just wanted my own separate base. There's no problem with that. That's exactly it. I told you a long time ago. You didn't tell me anything and just kept quiet. Although I'm your best friend. So I didn't want you to be here. That's the end of the conversation. This is only my rainbow base and no one else's. I really couldn't imagine that you could do something like that, much less tell me. You're my best friend, and I thought we supported each other all the time. Mikey, run here as fast as you can and we'll solve everything. Then we'll figure out whose rainbow base it will be, and then there won't be any problems. It's only mine! You want to take it over and I won't let you do that! There's no way rainbow base will be yours. Friends, you have to settle our dispute, because I don't understand what Mikey wants at all. He's really acting weird. I want Mikey to trust me and invite me to events like this. He doesn't want to invite me anywhere, and it's like he's refusing me. That's why I think the best solution is to punish him. What do you think? Will there be other options? Hey, you shouldn't be here at all. There's no point in you deciding anything because it won't have any effect. We can fight one-on-one, -on, -one, on my terms and settle everything on the spot. Okay, what are the rules of your battle? Maybe I'll agree, and then we'll all decide who's right and who's wrong in all this. It'll be a battle with sticks and shields. Whoever throws their enemy out of here will win. Sounds really simple to me. Okay, Mikey, I more than agree with that. Because there's no point in running around and thinking about anything anymore, especially chasing you around your rainbow base. Let's try to fight you one-on-one. -on -one. Okay, I'll get everything ready and you can go and rest for now. Because I'll win this battle and you'll forget about this place forever. Friends, this will be a truly legendary battle that I need to take part in. This is the only way I can drive Mikey away and take the rainbow base for myself. It will be really cool. I still can't understand why Mikey did all this. Maybe he'll reveal his secret before our battle. I'll be very interested to know. JJ, I'm almost ready. Let's try to fight you. My goal with all this is these rainbow gems. They're really unbelievably cool. I got a whole chest of them and decided to make my own rainbow base to turn it into a village. This is really weird. But let's fight with rainbow sticks. They should be much stronger as a weapon and easier to fight with. Hmm, that does sound like a plan. But maybe you want to fight with a regular stick so I don't destroy you by accident. I definitely want to fight you with the rainbow wand. It will be really cool and we will be able to show off all our skills. I want to beat you in your own battle on your terms and rules. It will be really cool. Then get ready for this battle. We must give it our all and push each other down. It will really mean that one of us has definitely won. I understand you perfectly, Mikey. Everything will be done the way you want because I can calmly punish you and prove that I am stronger. Let's show our friends a real fair battle. Then they will definitely be satisfied and only one of us will win. I will attack you and you will definitely lose. 
because this is my battle and I am able to defeat you without any problems. Mikey really prepared for this battle, so I need to come up with a tactic on how to win. Without tactics, I have no business here. He is much more experienced in this. How good that the arena is big and I have a little time to think to defeat him once and for all so that he won't say anything else. I'll run around you and hit you in the back. This is my tactic and you won't be able to do anything about it. I'm much more experienced in this battle. I'll make you tired and then just throw you out of my rainbow base. No one will be able to drag me out of here and defeat me. Mikey already has a plan and I need to think of mine as quickly as possible. This will definitely help me defeat him. Ha ha ha, how funny it is to watch you, that you can't do anything and especially defeat me. It will be unrealistically easy for you. The more you talk, the faster I'll destroy you, Mikey. You'll see, I'll defeat you and rule this rainbow base. You're already tired and don't know what to do. This is truly the funniest thing that could have happened. You have to understand that you have no other choice. I will win this battle. I'm really starting to get tired of this fight. I need to go somewhere and catch my breath. Only then will I be able to continue fighting against Mikey, but he won't give me time. You already want to give up and I can see it in you, but now there will be a final attack that will push you down. A running attack! I thought of it. I'll just dodge at the last moment and Mikey will fall down. It will be awesome! <laughs>